Hey YouTube, this is Chris again with another one of Tim and Chris's how-to videos. Today I'm going to show you how to fix your slow or freezing computer with free programs. That's right, free programs. Now the programs I normally use to do this are CCleaner, Malwarebytes, and Spybot Search and Destroy. Now many of you may have heard of these or may have even used these, but if you haven't, I'm going to show you how to get them and how to use them. So let's get started. So first go to your browser of choice, mine is Google Chrome. And in the address bar we're going to type in download.com. This is where uh, I get a lot of my uh, downloads and stuff from. So now we're going to type in um, CCleaner. And you'll see it come up here, CCleaner. And do the same thing for malware bytes and search and destroy. Malware bytes right here. And it's right, you know, it's right here. And what you do is basically, um, we also do search and destroy. Let's just do that real quick. Search and destroy. And so what you do is, uh, what you find it, you go to your, you can download it here or you can go to the page and you can read about it, check it out. <clears throat> and when you're ready, you just go ahead and download that. Right here, download down. So those are the programs that I normally use. CCleaner, Malwarebytes, and Search and Destroy. So once you've downloaded them, what we'll do is we'll first clean the computer. So we'll go to open up CCleaner. And when CCleaner opens up, it looks like this. Let me make this a little shorter for the window here. So um, first thing you do is you go to the cleaner tab. Go to the cleaner tab and run cleaner. And generally this is pretty fast. Um, if you do it, I do it every couple of days. Um, if you haven't ever done it, it's going to take you know a few minutes. But generally this is pretty fast. And all it's doing is clearing the cookies and all this pretty much everything that you need to uh, clear look all the space that you can save here and I'll always run it um, two or three times I'll just run it twice and every time you run it it'll uh, it'll be faster each time so then after you do um, run the cleaner go ahead and click on registry and scan for issues and if you have any issues they'll come up just like this now once uh, once it's done it's hundred percent you go to fix selected issues and it'll ask you if you want to back these changes up, say yes. And just slap it on your desktop, leave everything as it is, just put it right on your desktop and save. And then click, and then it'll save a file like this, and I'll tell you about that in a second. Then go to click, um, excuse me, fix all selected issues. And close it. Now you'll want to run the registry a couple of times because there may be some pieces uh, that you need, it needs to, that didn't, it didn't get all the way. So let's see if it got everything. No issues were found. So if something happens or whatever after you've cleaned your registry and you're like, oh man, I shouldn't have cleaned it. I messed up, blah, blah, blah. Well, not to worry. That's what this backup's for. And I will show you right now. If we uh, we just scanned for issues and there was no issues found, we'll scan again right quick. It's really fast. No issues were found. So what we could do is double click on this. Yes. Yes. Okay. And if we scan for issues now, it's going to find everything because we just put it all back, basically. <clears throat> and there we go. Everything's all back. So fix it. No, I don't need it this time. And we'll rescan again. No problems. Okay, so keep this around for a couple of days or whatever and uh, see what's going on. So, um, now that's CCleaner. Now we're going to get to uh, Malwarebytes. And Malwarebytes is um, virus removal. And just open up. And what you want to do, the first thing you want to do is update it. And this, you know, sometimes depending it takes a while or not. But once you update it, um, you'll get a green check here and you just click scan now. That's malware bytes. And just let it do its thing. You know, it takes some time. Just let it do its thing. Spybot search and destroy. Same thing. You want to update it. And when you, uh, after you update it, um, go ahead and run that cleaner. 
and it'll it'll uh, search out viruses or whatever that you uh, that you may or may not have. So, if you do all that and you're still freezing up and your computer's still not running uh, too good, um, I'm going to uh, put a um, a link here for another video that we have uh, specifically for that if if all if all this stuff here doesn't work um there's other things that we can do to help solve your problem uh, a lot of it deals with ram and i get go into that in that video so i'm going to put that video um uh let's say about here and also a link in the description uh, so you can just click on that video and go to it and check it out well i hope this video has helped you please subscribe comment if you like thanks for watching have a good day.